Hi, girls. Hi. 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 Today I have faced one terrible situation because cat crossed my crossed my way, and it was so terrible. I was afraid. Why were you afraid? Because you know, in our country, if cat crosses our way, it means like it will bring us um, bad luck. So you also believe in it? Yes, of course. Yeah, actually, I didn't know about that, but it turns out that there are many people who are believing it. And uh, we, just today, we'll talk about it. So we are junior students of Fumi Mandimir University, and um, in our third year, we are taking course teaching intercultural communication in English. And um, my name is Akubek, and I am correspondent of this group. My name is Ayuram. My name is Mbat. My name is Dinara. Let's start. So today in this project, we are going to talk about plans of the poster presentation. What is ICC? What is PBL and low context, high context? Our critical incident. They call me bad luck. Am I? ICC objectives and plus one project products. So what is ICC? Intercultural communicative competence refers to the ability to understand cultures and including your own and use this understanding to communicate with people from other cultures successfully. So what is PBL? Project-based learning is a teaching method in which students learn by actively engaging in real world and personally meaningful projects. And the next question, what is high and low context cultures? A higher context culture relies on intuitive communication and an unverbal cues. In higher context communication, a message cannot be understood without a great deal of background information. Asian, African, Arab, Central European, and the Latin American cultures are generally considered to be higher context cultures. A low context culture relies on expertise communication. In low context communication, more of the information in a message is spelled out and defined. Cultures with Western European roots, such as the United States and Australia, are generally considered to be low context cultures. Um, so, our project based on uh, our ICC incident that happened with Akhubek in Lithuania with her Indian and Korean friends. When Akhubek saw a cat, she went closer to cat and took him in her hug. And her Korean friend shook it and asked why she was taking it in her hug. And she explained their beliefs and Indian uh, friends also supported Koreans. So, this was about bad luck. Uh, what can we remember when they say bad luck? Of course, cats especially black cats, and also about other superstitions that bring bad uh, luck in different countries, such as ladder, uh, scissors, and so on. Is it possible to believe in this? How true is that? Uh, what is superstition and why do we use them? So we invite you to learn about the most terrible believers that should not be ignored. Hypothesis of the incident. We hypothesize in other countries and Kazakh superstitions have similar and different superstitions to bad luck. And the subject of the incident is the similarities and differences between the most famous and commonly used superstitions for bad luck and in our and other countries. Uh, so, let me introduce our project aims. Uh, students will be able to integrate the intercultural dimension into any topic or unit of the student's worksheet or the instructions for students ESL or EFL students and to improve our communication and the general work abilities, soft abilities, period management abilities and the task completion abilities and so on. And our unit aims uh, so create a superstition diagram of this insider, use a lot of information related to other superstitions so that can you illustrate and then improve our um, skills such as critical thinking, communication and collaboration skills, narrative skills, problem solving skills, and uh, also creative skills. And finally, uh, our project products. Uh, so at first, our um, students worksheets were with all our tasks and um, activities on our intercultural uh, communicative incidents. And then um, the second one is teachers guidelines with all the keys of our uh, tasks. And uh, the third one is PowerPoint presentation, uh, which we would use it um, in order to conduct a lesson based on previous worksheets. And uh, the next our product is video presentation of project poster. Our it's our final project, and um, uh, which you are watching it now. 
and uh, the last one is Rubix for self, peer, and uh, external viewers. So, uh, according to our project, so go to the description, and there is a link where you can leave your feedback about our project. Thank you for your attention and uh, spending time. Take care of yourself and uh, stay at home. Goodbye.